Okay, everybody, so today I'm not going to do a gameplay video, but I really want to record this. Metal Assault is coming to Steam. Why do I care? Because I've been trying to figure out where this game has been for the last eight years, I think. Eight years. I started playing this when I was 12 years old. When I was 12 years old. Hopefully when it comes out on Steam on March 1st. I sh which means it should be out already. But that's not the point. Um, when it does come out, I'm hoping that I can use my old account. If not, I'll, u I'll make a new account. I'll probably just make a new account because I don't remember what my old account is. Uh, but this game is basically it's a 2D uh, platform scroller. If you've heard of Boring Man, um, it's similar to that gameplay-wise. But in this, you get like three or four different starting class types that you can pick from, and uh, they're also sex-based as well, so it's kind of got a little RPG aspect to it. Um, right there, RPG. So you pick your guy. I picked this guy because he looked cool. And I didn't really care about anything else when I was 12. But in this game, you can go in, you can get guns. You can get really good guns, all for free. None of them. The only things you really pay for are aesthetic things, like costumes and stuff, or at least that's how it used to be. How it will be when it comes out on Steam, I have no idea. But it looks really good. I really like the whole fact that the, the game's coming to Steam. I'm definitely going to jump on it as soon as it is. The only reason why I haven't is because I there is no download button. And when I went and looked it up, I couldn't find it. So I think maybe the original developers like lost the game or something and now they're bringing it back. Because I couldn't find it. Like I found the name Metal Assault and then I went and Googled it to try to download it to play it right now. Um, and I'm going to go look again right after I record this. And if I do... I'll go ahead and uh, record some of that for you, because I love this game. This game was great. This was my favorite game, actually, for shooters, because um, my old computer 12 years ago wouldn't even play games like Team Fortress or anything. I mean, it barely ran this. Barely. But it ran, and I loved it. It was great. So, yeah. And uh, you can bet your ass that as soon as it does come out, I'm going to put my review in there now I'm gonna put this video on there um, so my thoughts pre pre so it's not not here yet thoughts pre release is that uh, I love it like I recommend it to many people I would I would I mean it's a great game it has a lot of potential um, it's already finished I mean they have a cool little zombie mode I played that a couple times. I didn't really like it. I mainly did battle mode because this one was like team deathmatch, shit like that. It was good. I liked it. So, yeah. Yeah, Carl. See? You get a pick out of four. I was right. Out of four. But you can like uh, pick his skin color, his hair color, and all that cool shit. You know, it doesn't... Like, you don't have to look like him. You know? It's just the base character. Kind of like in a lot of other ones. And then this guy... I can't tell if you can see that, but this guy right here, he's like the tank. And then this chick is a sniper, and then this chick is, uh, I don't know, explosives? I don't remember. But then this guy's just a general, like he's, he's he just uses whatever, like assault rifles, pistols, things like that. And uh, there are gun locked things, like only certain classes can use certain guns. So I, I picked Carl because he had the even stats, uh, and he looked cool. That was it. I mean, it was either him or him, because I don't like to play female characters at all. Unless it is really fucking worth it, okay? And so the only game that I actually do play a female character on is going off topic. But the only character I go off topic or fucking um, break that rule with is uh, Arc Blade, I think it's called? Let's see, hold on. Arc yeah, Arcblade. And I'll probably record some Arcblade, too. Because I like playing that. 
So, yeah. And the other thing that brought me into the game when I was 12 was that uh, that chick has some nice boobs and a nice butt. Can't really blame me, I was 12. But, hopefully when it comes out, I can get back into the game. It was a great game. I am really, really excited for it. So, I don't know what the whole deal is. I don't know why I can't find it. I'm gonna go look for it again real fast. But, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video and listening to me talk about stupid shit and how I'm hyped up. And, uh, I'll see you in the next one. Okay, everybody, so I, I looked into the game a little bit more, and it turns out the game did get shut down at some point, but you can get your, you can sign up for the beta here on this website at uh, idcgames.com slash metal assault, you know, th this link right here, I'll leave it in the description below, I'll even copy it right now for you. Okay, and you can go here and sign up, and uh, the beta, which I'm assuming when the beta hits on the website, the beta will also hit on Steam, but I went ahead just in case that was not the case, I went ahead and signed up anyway. So, my old account is gone, but they're going to have new 8v8, which is, it was not a thing when I played, or at least I don't think it was. So... The game will come out in one to two months after the announcement was posted, and this announcement was posted on March 10th. So, hopefully in a month or two this game will be out, and uh, I can get on and do some great recording of it. Because I love this game. Okay? So, I think that's about all. I'm just going to throw this on the end of that other clip, and... Uh, Hope you enjoyed the video, and this time for real, I'll see you in the next one.